video we're in Robin Hood's Bay. We have chips, beer, Louis gets a new jumper. Hoodie. We have a big announcement to make. And it rains. We're in a very wet and windy Robin Hood's Bay. So we're straight to the pub. A bit hot. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, they're crispy. Very good. Yeah, nice. What? It's a cat score. Um, seven. Seven out of ten. Maybe a six. Six. It went down then. Really crispy though. I love crispy chips. Chips. And fixed to the beer. A wine. Woohoo! A bit of a wine. What else would you do on a rainy, wet day in Robin Hood's Bay? Um, go down to see the beach, but we'll do that in a bit. Okay. I have to go rid of that. Oh, I really like them. I think they could be a seven. They're nice and we? You approve? A bit did you like that then? Oh yes I did. And you nicked some of my pudding. Yeah well, got to share. Share? I know you don't like sharing. Are you ready Lou?
Well, I never knew Madonna lived down here. You did a cycle ride down here, didn't you? Yeah, we did. This year, earlier this year. Where from where to? Scarborough to Whitby. And how long did that take you? Uh, we just did it over a couple of days, spent the night in Whitby. 22 miles there, 22 miles back. It was good. And you stayed at a pub? We didn't stay at a pub, but we went to the pub. <laughs> did you have chips? We did. That's all right then. We're just walking down the old railway line that comes out at the campsite at Middle House Farm where we're staying tonight. Coming back to our campsite. Time for a cup of tea. Time for a cup of tea. There is another path down to the bottom of the harbour, which is down that track there, but it might be a bit muddy today. So we've just come through the village. Where we are, back at the campsite. It's a bit out of season, so there's not many people here. and we've just come across this black camper van which looks rather smart. This do us this, isn't it? There's nobody in it. Wonder what we're doing. Bay crack on the back. Let's see if there's anybody in it. shoes in it. It's got a Yorkshire mug. It's got our kettle. <laughs> Is this our camper van? Must be. What happened to the T5? Don't know. Did it's we grow out of it? Metamorphosized. It's our new toy. Here it is. Our shop, our medium wheelbase, high roof crafter van. What do you reckon Louis? Is it good? Do you like your new van? You having a drink? Takes up his usual position in the seat, just like it was his T5. Fixed bed at the back, leather seats, loads of storage. Special place for a whippet in his new jumper. Oh dear. TV. Heater. Solar panels. Garage in the back. Somewhere for all the wet suits to dry. So Joe, what happened then? saw this and thought, do you know what, we'll have it. And within a week we had it and we were wearing it. Had our T5 for a while though, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Seven years? Yeah, seven years. I will miss it. Oh, I will. We had some great times. Being from one end of the country to the other. Yep, yeah, loads of miles, but time to move on, time to get a bit bigger van. That crunching you can hear in the background is Louis having his dinner. With his hoodie on. With his new hoodie on. But uh, our T5 is um, a friend of ours has bought it and it'll be coming on our trips and it'll still be seen around. It's not just your bed, you know, Louis. That's for all of us, that. I think he thinks it is. Louis? Louis? That's not just your bed. That's for all of us. He definitely thinks that is his bed. Now, nice Louie. I am new spoiled, treats. Yeah. Do you like your new sweatshirt? You do realise if you're not a good boy, Brett wants to take your place. He's already <laughs> asked. <laughs> Louie? Want to swap places with Brett? You're a good boy. Mm. Isn't that nice? Oh, he likes them. Spoiled dog. 
Look, look how much room that whippet can take in bed. I'm supposed to lay there. What do you reckon? All the bed again, aren't you, Lou? You mm. like a new bed? Yes, it's really comfy. It's enough room, isn't there? Yeah, it's lovely. I'm six foot and I can lay out in it. So I do, really. But look at that whippet. Louie loves it, don't you, Louie? Eh? Oh yeah, just uh, to remember, we need to do a shout out for Worm's Eye View. So, Worm's Eye View is back online, so that's great. But now she's brought the channel back up, she's lost all her subscribers, so we all need to resubscribe. So if everybody could resubscribe to Worm's Eye View, that would be brilliant. Thanks a lot.